You've seen it. Those AI is killing creativity posts that all sound the same. That's what happens when you just use your AI instead of directing it. But once you build an AI assistant that knows your brand, your voice, your workflow, it stops guessing and starts performing. I can take my YouTube videos and feed their transcripts into ChatGPT, where my detailed prompt that has the context, the role, the instructions, and the rules with examples written inside helps me create new content super quick. The prompt sits in a project instruction you can do the same in a Claude project, a Gemini gem, or a perplexity space. I give it my brand, my style, audience profiles, data to help it understand my brand. And it then asks, what's the angle you'd like to take from this episode? I answer once, and it turns the video into LinkedIn and Instagram posts, carousel designs, newsletters, all formatted in my style and tone. Then I connect the workflow to AI imagery tools. And because ChatGPT knows my brand and I built the prompt right, it knows how to generate images closer to my style. I also use Gemini, Firefly, Freepik, or Midjourney, which I can train on my style so that the visuals match my brand. The mistake people make is thinking an AI will give perfect answers in a normal chat window, but an AI can't read your mind. Yet, it can only follow instructions. Your job isn't to outsource creativity, it's to direct it. And when you do, your AI will become a reliable creative partner. That's exactly what I teach in my course, how to build your own AI content creator using my prompt builder, which you get with the course. I walk you through how to build your assistant that is trained in your AI tool of choice on your brand, your tone, and your visuals. So if you want to create content with your AI that actually sounds like you, the link is in the description. Teach your AI how to think how to create like you and stop making it sound like everyone else's.